Hey guys, what's going on? It's Tyson here, and today I've got a very cool mind trick for you all that you can do to actually help you reduce calories, to help you stop overeating, and to actually help you lose body fat really quickly, all right? And this one's called controlling your portion sizes. So a long time ago, when I was going through my nutrition course, there were a couple of studies in there about people who ate different size servings of popcorn, and they gave these people different size popcorns. Some people got the large popcorn, some people got the small popcorn, and it was horrible tasting popcorn, right? But it didn't matter whoever got each size popcorn, whoever got the biggest size ate more. And that actually, they actually found out that that happens in other areas of our life too. So when it comes to eating dinner or breakfast or anything like that, the bigger serving size you have, and the more you're gonna eat regardless. It doesn't matter whether you think you're full or you're not, you'll go, your brain's gonna say, no, no, this is, um, this is a small, you know, you've still got food on the plate and you're gonna to wanna to eat it. But if you swap it to smaller, what's gonna happen is you're gonna be able to trick yourself to actually thinking that you're full and that you've eaten a lot more food when you actually have it. So let me give you an example. If you look at this plate, as opposed to this plate, the difference in this, right? You're probably, you're gonna fit a lot more, you're gonna fit a lot less on this one than this one. So let's say you fill up this with whatever you want and you can't fill up as much on this as this one. No matter how much you put on this and this, you're gonna be full either way. If you don't believe me, try it out. Get a normal size plate and eat whatever you usually would have, like you know, whether it be like steak and rice and chicken or your takeaway, whatever you guys are eating, I don't care. Give it a try. Then get a smaller plate and try and put as much food as you can on this one too, because obviously you're gonna put less on it. Your brain is actually gonna tell you you're full because you're gonna trick yourself to thinking, okay, well, you know, there's still a lot of food on here for this size serving a plate and you're gonna feel fuller after it. It's just a simple brain trick because our brain only will say, okay, there's still food here, we need to eat. And I'll give you another example. Let's say breakfast time. Look at this bowl as opposed to this bowl. If you look at the comparison right now, like if you look at it on the side, look how much deeper this one is than this. How much more cereal or whatever you're eating and milk is gonna be able to fit into this bowl as opposed to this bowl, all right? Now just think, if you tried, like let's say Cocoa Pops, okay? I would be able to fill a lot of Cocoa Pops up with this, and even if I didn't, if I filled it halfway, it would be more than this bowl. And so you're gonna eat more. But let's say you put less, like less Cocoa Pops and milk in this, right? You're gonna eat less, it's gonna be less calories, and you're gonna trick yourself to thinking you're full. You shouldn't be eating Cocoa Pops either way, but it's just an example, all right? So that's a really simple trick you guys can use. Just go out and buy some smaller items because they're actually cheaper instead of buying the larger stuff and give it a try. See what you can do, you know, see if you can actually, you see if you start realizing, oh wow, I'm eating less food because I'm having smaller portion sizes. And if you have the choice to choose a larger or a small bowl, always choose a smaller one. So I hope you liked the video guys. I hope it was informative. Make sure to like, share and subscribe because it really helps me out with this. Uh, share it with people who might always eat out of a bigger bowl or have bigger portion sizes and show them, you know, show them how they can actually trick their mind to help them lose weight. So as always, make sure to like and subscribe like I said and also join the newsletter because I share things on that newsletter that I'm not going to share over here. So that's it for the video guys and I'll speak to you next time.